Okay, now let's talk about semicolons. This is one of my favorite parts of uh, Swift. You do not need to put semicolons at the end of your lines uh, for code to compile. So for example, I mean in Objective C, obviously this is an Objective C, um, but if you were to make a variable or do, I mean any sort of thing, uh, you had to put a semicolon in the end like this, right? Um, and it's acceptable in Swift. It's not going to uh, throw an error and it, the code will compile, but you don't need it. Um, I mean, you can totally do without and that's completely valid in Swift. Uh, one way to use the semicolon is if you do put it there, you can uh, write another line here. So maybe you want to say a dog name now equals Fido. Um, so you can see how you can kind of, I don't know if this is the greatest way for, you know, reading code. Uh, I don't think this would necessarily be a good practice, but you can see how um, you can do multiple statements in one line using the semicolon. Uh, but again, this is something that makes Swift extremely simple and I love a lot is that you don't need that semicolon. Death to the semicolon.